today's special news. Chief Minister Pinarayi Vijayan announced Section 144 as per COVID-19 situation in Kerala. COVID has been confirmed in 8,553 people in the state. The disease is transmitted through contact with 7,527 persons. The source of 760 cases is not clear. More than 1,000 cases have been reported in Kodikod and Ernakulam districts. More than 500 people are infected in 6 districts. 58,727 samples were tested within 24 hours. Today, 23 COVID deaths have been confirmed, bringing the total number of COVID deaths to 836. Our reporters join us with the details of various districts. Uttara Arnaya join us with the news of Kotem districts. Uttara, how about the details of Kotem districts? Yes, Devika, in Kotem district, 474 people have confirmed COVID on Sunday. It is estimated that there will be a significant increase in the number of participants of this week. Outbreaks appear to be exacerbated in four municipalities including Kotem and Changnasheri and in Tiduan other Punjais. Gazetted officers of various departments have been appointed to control the spread of the disease in the local bodies. Officers other than Health and Revenue Police Local Self-Government have been appointed in the first phase. 94 officers were posted in the district. They have the power to take disciplinary actions against COVID protocol violators and to register cases with the help of the police. The district collector had yesterday ordered that 10% of beds in private hospitals should be reserved for COVID patients. Hospitals that do not comply with this order will be prosecuted. This is the news in Kotem district related to COVID-19. Thank you. COVID-19 restrictions on weddings and other ceremonies were imposed as per the COVID circumstances. Nandana and Suresh from the capital joins for the details. Nandana, what are the major details from the capital? The directors of the district issued the order. The prohibitory order will be valid for one month. However, public transport will not be affected. Gathering of over five people has been prohibited. No gathering will be allowed it inside and outside containment zones. Shops, banks and government establishments will remain open. There will be no change in the examinations. People can participate in wedding and funerals under strict limitations. 20 people will be allowed it to attend funerals while 50 people will be allowed to attend weddings. Only a maximum of 20 people can take part in the government, religious or political events. Self-government organizations and police will try to prevent gathering of people. Over five, over five people being present inside hotels, restaurants and other shops will be considered a violation of Section 144. These are the news related to the Section 144 in Kerala. Thank a total of 246 cases of COVID-19 protocol violations were registered in the capital yesterday. Anjali Araji join us with its details. Anjali, what are the main cases under COVID protocol? Yes, Devika, district collectors of all the 14 districts involved in section 144 of the criminal procedure code prohibiting the crowding of more than 5 people in the public place at 9 a.m. of Saturday. Police registered 25 cases and arrested 11 for vaulting resistance under the providence on Saturday. One of the cases was in the capital White Column City had 4, 2 in Idiki and 9 each in Trishur and Kodikot City. 10 arrested for unloan assembled were made in Column while one of the arrested in Idiki in Kasargod district. This section has been imposed only till October 9, while it will be forced everywhere till midnight of October 31. Gathering more than 5% will not be allowed in front of any banks, shops or comical establishment. Within the containment zone, there will be a statement measures including movement, persistence and permanent control. Only essential activities like selling medicines and food items like milk, vegetables, meat, fish and essential services like revenue, health, police, LSGD, power, water supply, etc. will be hello. Thank you. With this, today's news time ends. Thank you.